Kelly Rio. Behind the glass curtain, we got Shalom to the people. One, the only second seed in the building with a band. A uh, booty band. <laughs> there you go. I'll let you say it. You can open it as well. <laughs> <laughs> booty band. <laughs> I booty will band. not. I will not. In the house, we got Augustina Fitness. In the house, we got Kelly. You can get closer on there. Okay. Kelly's in the building. Yeah, uh, so, th this oh. band. Yes. That you have explained. Oh, I need this. So it's a strength band, oh, and uh, the strength. girls love it because it's it makes smart. your booty tighter, right. higher, and bigger. Wow. And the guys love it because it strengthens your legs, and it's good for knee rehab as well as hip re rehab. Well, it's, I literally just went to the orthopedic this morning, mm -hmm. and because I have water in my knees and edema. He told me to get one of these and do these exercises for my knees. There you go. That's so like, See how I play Look at God. See how I play Right. <laughs> Won't he do it? <laughs> All right, so how did you come up with this? So. Uh, Nick, are we getting this? on? Okay. I've been in the fitness industry for so, so, so long. And I've used numerous uh, strength bands, and they all snap, or they break, or, or they get, or they roll. And I needed something that was stronger, sturdier, and that it was going to last for a long time. So we Feels did it. Feels great. Wow. Because it's hard to pull it, so imagine putting it on your legs. And then uh, do you work out with it the whole time, right, in the gym you wear it? You have yeah, it for the most part, when you're doing legs or if you're doing any rehab, you know, knee rehab. Oh, it's a girl on there. I didn't see that. <laughs> That's me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> That's my logo. <laughs> I, just, I didn't know what was on there. And I was like, oh, I see a body. Oh, okay, that's dope. Thank you. And it's called? Augustina Fitness. Uh, fucking hilarious. I did not see that. On there. <laughs> it's weird. Now I see it. I can't stop seeing it. I'm like, okay, I see it on there. But you can use that too to work out. Yeah, I was going to get one for my son. So yeah. he can. Cause it's, oh, I, he would love that. Definitely. Yeah. Because you, you play ball, so yeah. that. Use it for explosion. You get closer on that mic. Use Go it ahead. for explosion. You know, as an athlete, uh -huh. uh, that's that's a big thing for yeah. you know basketball. I'm a basketball player, so I'm going to speak in our uh, our preference. But uh, explosion is the number one thing. Uh, uh, small forward or two small forward shooting guard. Oh, I yeah. let that thing fly. Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'll that would be good for a football player? My son plays. Football. Oh, definitely. Right. Like I said, um, it, it gets your legs strong. Uh, I was a little against it just because I felt like it was a girl thing, but mm -hmm. I, I went ahead and tried it out, and um, you see results. You, but you got to be consistent with it. Mm -hmm. uh, but after consist consistency and um, actually using it to its potential, you see results. Most of the ones I've seen, they roll down and they don't feel like this. Right. And, yeah. yeah. And, and she gets a lot of feedback. You know, she gets a lot of feedback that uh, that's one thing that girls complain about is well, it rolling, and. We haven't had any problems since. Well, Shelly's eyes went up when we said, what is it called? A booty band. A yeah. booty band. She went, I need a booty. So <laughs> I don't know about the band. Because in my defense, so when, Turn I, lose, her mic up when I lose weight, the first thing that goes for me is my booty. Mm -hmm. So or I need butt. my booty back. <laughs> so I don't like that. But I also so do that, a lot of cardio. So, But I think you... I don't know why I keep saying you. I think you look fine. So when I'm bigger, I look like a black girl. You have I'm to keep like saying that. Girl. We're girls. We like to hear that all the time. Yeah, but it seemed like if, if I say it once, I meant it like every time. I see you, that you look fine. It's a, it's a battle. You're not going to win, man. Not gonna, <laughs> you're not going to win that battle. Like every day I go, you know you look good. You wake up tomorrow, you know you look good. <laughs> yeah. you wake up next day, you know, bitch, you look good. Do we, we have to do that every day? Yes. Every day. I just can't say what. We well. forget. We do so much. We cook. We clean. We take care of the kids. We do this, we do that. So we forget. And so then, you have to remind what's us. What's the one they do? Uh, how do I look in this dress? Don't that don't <laughs> never bite on that one. That's just go. You look nice. If you be like, well, I mean, shit, you will never get out. <laughs> you never leaving where you got to go. So my wife get dropped. Be like, uh, you look fine. I want to know the truth because no, change. you don't want to know the truth. You wouldn't ask me if you wanted to know the truth. There's a mirror right there that's telling you exactly what the fuck is going on. <laughs> you want me to go fuck with the mirror and say, you look fabulous, baby girl. I'll, your ass, the bumps and shit. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> they want us to lie that they couldn't see it in the mirror. But fuck it, we got to lie and go, I think that dress is. Or you, they wear the wrong shoes. And, and you, anybody, any brothers know, you go with your girl, she put the shoes on. These shoes hurt, but they, they wear them anyway. 
two hours or hour to where you at. My feet hurt. I'm ready to leave. I'm ready to leave. <laughs> now we gotta leave. Did you bring some extra shoes? No, I don't want to wear the flats in. I'm gonna be little. <laughs> this is why we come. Shit, I ain't even go. Cause you don't listen to me. I said don't wear the motherfucking shoes. Wear some tennis shoes. Tennis shoes. Hey, mm -hmm. this day and age, you can wear sneakers anywhere. In New York, not in L.A. Philly. Philly, see, where are you from? <laughs> Virginia. What part? Oh, seven five seven Virginia Beach all day. Oh, I had to shout it out. I had to shout it out. Been to Virginia Beach. Okay, all right. <laughs> <laughs> so that means I shouldn't go. No, you can go. Virginia yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Beach ain't no joke. It's pieces of Virginia. Uh, and then what college? Mount St. Mary's University. Ma located, have one here. Located in Maryland. Cause they have one here. They have one here. Yeah, but not the same. Same name. Mount St. Mary's. Same, same name. Yeah, same different, name. Different college. Uh, 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 what's his name? Uh, uh, Kimbo or Bo? Nah, nah. Nick, who was that that went to St. Mary's? Same, uh, yeah, St. Mary's. The basketball one. player? Yeah. St. Mary's, St. Mary's. What uh, made to the NBA? Uh, the only, don't, he, don't he play for the Spurs? Small guard? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. He did go to uh, St. Mary's. And he got buckets, too. Yeah, he got, he got buckets. What are you talking about? Um, man, Ford. put me on the spot. You um, pay attention Ford. to the show. Nigga. Nah. Two guard or, sm or small forward? No, nah, point guard. Point guard. Uh, uh, uh Murray. No, you got the dreads. You got the dreads. He's been he been in the league. Patty he Mills. Pa Patty Mills. Patty Mills. I don't he think he sure did go. To he got yeah. buckets too. Yeah. Oh yeah, Patty Mills. Yeah. A monster. Yeah. I, I like Patty. I liked him yeah. when he was just coming off the bench and he wasn't even starting. I thought Patty yeah. was. He got because it's it, it's like he not gonna stop. No. Nah. And and I was trying to tell my son. I, it's a commercial. There's a uh, Gatorade commercial that said all all sports players should have this model where. When you're playing, you should play against somebody that you think is better than you because they're sure. going to raise your game. Definitely. Or you find something that, about them that makes you just want to, uh, you're not going to beat me. Definitely. Think. So that's that's how it was. I I could take the smallest thing. If you had on the wrong pair of socks, that was my motivation. Like, <laughs> this with these, these jeans on ain't going to beat me. Like, <laughs> it's not going to happen. So I had to find something. So we got fitness. Uh, so do you train or? Yeah, I'm still training. Do you train? So... People can come to you trained. Do they get the band with the train? Yeah, they they can get the band if you want them. Yeah. If you want the band. If, and but, how much is the band? Most of, right now they're on sale for twenty four dollars. Oh, that's not bad. They're at all. usually thirty eight. And uh, but for the most part, if they come and train with me, you know my clients don't buy it mm. right away just because they don't like to work out on their own. <laughs> so, but if you like to work out on your own and you're motivated, you can either. Shelly. Hey. What we've been going to twenty four hour fitness since January, uh -huh. and she has girls walking around that gym wearing her bands. Oh wow! You know, so wait a minute. You've seen one, huh? No, I'm saying if I, my son is walking around with one on and off, well, I guess all the girls. I guess. But <laughs> but that's the thing. You could use that on your own. Like I said, I'm gonna just flip it around. <laughs> <laughs> what? No, but, but you can't no, tell. But, looking but at, I yeah, made no, it. I made that. it like this, so it would no, be for guys too. Was, that's why I didn't make them pink. No, well, yeah, there's some highlights in there. <laughs> so the reason why we go to that gym, my son's like, there's some cute girls here. I'm like, yeah. Are you serious? Yes. Oh my we do. Hey, motivation. My son's a, he's a dude, so we go there because it's cute girls. Motivation. I don't like 24. I used to go to 24 on Sepulveda and mm. Ventura. I used to hate going there because well, everyone's putting makeup on. They're doing selfies. <laughs> I'm like, I came here to work out. I feel like I need a new outfit. <laughs> <laughs> so I used to join Crunch, and I'm like, I'm good. Crunch is great. I don't have to worry Down about it. this way. On DeSoto and Perdino. Yeah. Ain't Crunch like a lot of old people? No, uh, she wouldn't so. know because they ain't taking pictures. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but, but I mean, they're, they do. If you go at like ten, then all the influencers come in. So I'm like, okay, don't way? go at ten. You know the in Instagram influencers. Oh, in I never heard that before. Dude, yeah. some gyms have where influencers come in for an hour for free and just do videos all day. Really? I've right. never heard of that. Wow. So Crazy. who's on the picture? Is it you? That's me. <laughs> so we've been knowing each other a long time. I ain't. Uh, yeah, uh, Nick. So you I gotta find a way to get the picture up or go to the website what's I've the website gotten better you met me when i first started doing this when you're when your son because your son is how old now 15 yeah him in brooklyn same age mm -hmm. and uh so i think he came to brooklyn's when it was 10 or something at the house yeah yeah it was, and then now they're all grown uh yeah these are yeah and so that's the band for the weights so that's the sweat belt that and you put it on while you work out and then when you take it off it's like all sweat dripping down well, I don't leave till I'm sweating. So That's you? Yeah. 
You know hey, she be on her grind, man. That's one thing I had wow. to get there. Wow. But that's like bronze and no. Well, I had a tan. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's a, that's a tan. <laughs> you know, put that right there. <laughs> Wait, so do you, do you guys work together? Are you guys dating? Like, yeah. Yeah, we have a baby. We're dating. We're no. People together. are asking. Are they a couple? Oh, yeah, I'm not asking. The girls are <laughs> yeah. Call in. They, they want to call in. Be like, hey, can I speak to the guy in the corner? <laughs> yeah, you can call in. Yeah, they they have a little boy, and he was. Oh, you really do have a boy. Oh, yes, I, know, I didn't know if you were kidding. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so Shelly, cool. I'm starting to think you don't believe things I say. <laughs> I and then she bought him up. Uh, yeah, we have a 15 year old. Oh, I mean, a 15 month old. Oh, okay. and he came years. upstairs and took over the gym. Oh, really? All the women were over oh, there. Hey, there we go. He steals the spotlight. Yeah. A lot. He's so cute. For, is, is first son? My first son. That's beautiful, man. So he's going to be in the court. He's going to be getting his ball on. Hey, man. For the minute, he, he throws the ball now, but oh, he does? the minute there I can get go. him out there, he's going out there. Oh, so his hair straight. I thought he would have Well, his hair straight at the front and then it's, curly in the back. It's weird. You no, know, he got that professional look in the front, <laughs> hard in the back, you know? But you know what? So my, my first son, his dad's Italian, mm-hmm. and, and I'm half black and white, and so his hair was super straight. And like, mm-hmm. and then as he got older, it just his hair was curly like mine. See, we still haven't cut his hair yet. Yeah, I feel like his hair is definitely going to get more curly. Right. Yeah. Well, so if you want the band, where do they go if they want the band? Augustinafitness.com. What if they can't spell that? A-G-O-S-T-I-N-A-F-I-T-N-E-S-S. You you didn't see this, Augustina. Y'all didn't see that. (laughs) (laughs) There we go. Instagram Augustina Fitness because <laughs> it was blurry I as fuck. I still have it. I still have it. I can't get rid of it. It's, I don't want to. No, it was great. The band for sure. If you're getting nothing else, even if you can't, and if they want to to uh, train or be, have you train them, they go to the same place. Or they can go on Instagram. Okay, and you go to Instagram, which is Augustina at Augustina Fitness, and uh, if you're in the area, she's always at 24. So are you able to take? Does the client have to sign up? Uh, well, I can't train at 24 Hour Fitness because I'm not a 24 Hour Fitness Oh, that's trainer. right. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you can play it off. Hey, that's my friend. Right. First, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You go there enough. Hey, you got to meet people. That's <laughs> what I do. Uh, so if you need someone to train you, Shelly, you're going to put get the band uh, to work yeah. your... I need to get one today. <laughs> like literally after the show, I was like, I need to go find one of those. They're right here. Well, that's right. <laughs> I know. That's what I'm that's saying. Why, yeah. That's why I brought two. Yeah, it's two. No excuses. Yeah, no excuses now. So Shelly's working on her butt. I told you it's fine. I'm pretty sure Tony told you it's fine. He does, but it's for me. Doesn't matter if we say anything. They don't, they don't, they don't hear us, man. No. They don't hear us. What the fuck we got to do, Shell? Say it but, every but here's day. the thing. If we said, you ain't got no ass, then the whole world fall apart. <laughs> but you said she has ass. <laughs> <laughs> it is a problem. But I tell you, you got an ass. You, your ass is fine. Eh. No. <laughs> it's the negative part. The, the negative part they, they hone in on. So we were doing, so y'all were supposed to call in. Uh, Nate Dogg's birthday, well, birthday's today. He passed away. Uh, he's, he's not with us, but we were thinking who had Nick, who had the top, who was the top person on the hook? And I, the other lady said T Pain is not in the picture. And I'm like, yes, he is. I don't know. T Pain got some. Mon- I would but, say, <laughs> listen, if you ask me. So it's T Pain, Sleepy Brown. So it's, maybe you got to play a, a, a piece of everybody. I'm going to say the dream. In my era, I'm going to say the dream. The dream came out, the whole album, who, I, every <laughs> song, the hook was smacking, every song. But whose other song was he on? That he and I'm gonna say Neo. I'm gonna throw okay. Neo in the loop. I'm gonna say Weekend. That's respect. But what era are we doing? Yeah, ain't nobody listening to the Weekend hooks though. His songs is here. What, what era are we doing? Let's I mean, let's let's go for the '90s right now. But but you got we saying hooks. Who has? Because that's what Nate did. He did hooks. He what did? Okay, who had the best hook in the '90s? Nate. Y'all think Nate dog? Uh, I was gonna say uh, Black Street. I was gonna say Black Street and uh, what's my man's name? On whose album? They whole album. What you mean? The one song they did with Dre? Okay, maybe you understand what I'm saying. So if you take if you play take Nate Dog and Nate's on Fabulous album, he's on. uh, I mean, on on a song, he's on certain songs that he does the hook on, so he killed it. Sleepy Brown was on the hook for. Well, he on fifties. Yep, yeah, twenty one questions. Twenty one questions. Yeah, okay, you right. I'm gonna have to go Nate Dog. Nate Dog. <laughs> Nate, Nate Dog got hey, the most classic. I was say Nate Dog. Now T Pain's close. T Pain right there. 
Uh, now, what about in, what about rappers? You said you from the East Coast. From the East Coast. Man. Okay, this, this is push a good topic for you. Uh, time out. Time out. What do you say? You said push a T. You gonna say push T right now? Push. Okay, I didn't hear the question. I just got <laughs> I got excited over here. I, but, hey, I'm from Virginia. <laughs> oh, you from Virginia? Yeah. Okay, that, I thought you said the East Coast. But you Virginia, Virginia. Right, right, yeah, that's East Coast. No, no, I was thinking New York and stuff. That's why no, you said push nah, T. I was confused. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, yeah. I'm like, no, nobody in New York like push a T. That's nah, a little confused. From New York. My family's from uh, Bad News, Virginia. So yeah. Uh huh. Bad News. I rock with you. Push okay. a T on that level. Right, I rock. I've been to Richmond and. Uh, but, ain't, but ain't the same. Yeah, what that's am I talking about, Rich? What the hell? Oh, that's, 80, that's 804. <laughs> this guy talking about Rich. Well, oh, I drove, uh, uh, I rode with uh, 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 Tim. I Tim, I had name. never been, this was, you was two. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I had never been out of out of uh, Cali, and his uh, cousin was like, yo, you want to ride with me to Virginia? Mm-hmm. Like, sure. Took us, this is how long ago, because I'm pretty sure I'm way over everybody at the table. It took us three days, and at the time there was ESPN hadn't gotten to Cali. That's how far back it was. It was eighty two. You, know, you was like three. You probably wasn't born. No, you no. You. Anyway, it was some time ago. I, I experienced some things, and we went to uh, Norfolk, Virginia. Okay. In Richmond, in Norfolk. Yeah. So that's how far are you from Norfolk? Right there. Oh, see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm uh, Norfolk, Virginia Beach, Chesapeake. They all. On top of each other, and it was so weird when when you introduced me. I said he do something, and Brooklyn was like, "No, nah, you play basketball, Dad." I'm like, "Okay, I know he do. I know he ain't in the gym, looking like an action figure. So I know you were just in there chilling. So I said he had to do something. So you still play, or you still got the urge, or yeah, I haven't played since December. That was my last time picking like, a basketball up. Shut up. Yeah, yeah. I just been focused on wow. you know getting bigger. So, wow. Yeah. Like bigger, like yeah, man. I, during the basketball season, I always got. I just. It was either basketball or it was working out. I, I never did both. Okay. You know, I was I was that guy. But uh, now that I'm done with basketball, you know, I've been focused on just the All right, we got a phone call. Caller, what's your name? Where you calling from? Yo, it's L out of Houston. What it do, L? Take that L. What's going on? What's up, man? Hey, man, so you basically talk to speed. You're talking about features, people that are featured on other people's People People that's featured on – and usually Nate Dogg's always a feature. And I guess T-Pain yeah. would be a feature most of the time on the ones he did. Well, I, I, yeah, I'm just saying because he was confusing. He was confusing Nick because he was talking about. I was going to say that's what I but thought you, too. But you mean, yeah, you mean features. Yeah. Um, so definitely two that I can think of off top. Um, they they were hard on features, but the albums did okay. or did pretty good. Okay. Um, well, not okay. They did really good, but Method Man for sure. Oh, that's a good um, choice. On on features. Uh huh. Method Man always went hard. And of course, uh, Wayne. Lil Wayne went hard too on features for sure. I'm gonna have to agree. Yeah, Lil Wayne as far as a feature and doing the hook. Wayne will come in, will come in and destroy who yeah. he was featuring on. You know? Yeah. All yeah. right. Yeah, I like those that. Two, those are two that I have that come to mind. All right. Thank you, L. Appreciate that. All right, man. Features. Oh, if we're talking about features, if we skip into the 2000s, of course we're gonna have to say Drake. Yeah, because every song he's on, he makes it his song. So I'm gonna have to throw Drake in the pot. But but I'll, I think he also becomes like, or his his cadence is like whoever song it is. I agree. Yeah. So, so my man's from Virginia. So this is a little biased question, of course. But how do you feel about the Pusha T and uh, Drake battle? Who do you think won that? Now that it's all now that it's all it's all over with now. See, so I'm, I'm speaking from bias. <laughs> 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 I'm going go straight. So Pusha is he T. from Virginia? He's Pusha from Virginia. Virginia. Yeah. Oh, okay, that's what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. he's from Virginia. Yeah, Pusha from Virginia. You know, I mean, we see him on the streets. Well, he, he's you know, actually, so. you know, he was actually born in the Bronx. A lot no. of people don't know that. Pusha T was actually born in the Bronx. Don't, 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 don't take away from my shine. <laughs> right, right. He's not quiet. He was like, <laughs> what? Don't take away from my shine right now. <laughs> take the band. We need the band. We need the band. <laughs> so, wait, so you talking features or are we talking hooks? Because if we talking And features, L, you might have you blurred the line for me on that one because features is different than hooks. Nate Dogg did hooks. Okay, who's the I best? Who's the best feature hopes. artist of all time? So when they hop on somebody's track, it becomes their track. Who's the best feature artist? Who you got, Augustina? Who you got? You can pick a singer. Jay Z. Oh come on, hey. that's easy money right hey, there. You right? Hey. No, you right? You right? One hundred percent. You right? One hundred percent. That's easy money. Yeah. What about R and B singers? What about singers? What about female I, singers? Like I thought when when uh, R Kelly and Jay Z did. We can't talk about R Kelly on here. No, Ooh, no. We can. We can't. I ain't promoting him. I'm just saying that album. Let's get when they did the best of both worlds, <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> they destroyed. And then they had to do, even though uh, 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 Jay-Z didn't want to do the second album, he had to do that second album. Because everybody's like, dude, push that shit to the side, whatever was happening on tour, and go do the fucking album. And they, they even did good on the album they probably didn't want to do. Or Jay-Z didn't want to do. So, so I, I would say to me. R. Kelly? R. Kelly. I ain't gonna say R. Kelly. I'll pick somebody else. So. R. Kelly. <laughs> hey, I go R. Kelly. Kelly. I'm gonna go Usher. Uh, <laughs> I go Usher. Usher. I go Usher. You feel me? I, I can't rock with R. Kelly. I'm and sorry. what about you? I don't know. <laughs> you don't like country singers? Country? Yeah. No. It's oh, somebody okay. from Jersey you like? That Jersey is it? that Onyx? Is it Onyx? Yeah. No, Onyx from New York. We got a phone call. Caller, what's your name? Where you calling from? Oh yeah, Chris Brown on the hook. Yeah, shout out to Virginia. Oh uh, shit, it's a few of them. Usher, he did a few. Yeah, we said that. Fernie. Um, Ain't nobody said JD. What about JD? JD is more of a producer type of. But he's always on the he's always on the album though. Puffy. Yeah. Puff, Diddy. Damn, I forgot all yeah. about them. Yeah, yeah but he. Yeah. Now, where did Chris Brown bro- grow? Thank you, Vernon. Grow up. From where you were, because I just saw his thing on HBO. It was pretty dope. Te- Te- Tepe Hannock. Te- like, it's like Northern Virginia. No, oh, it, it it's ain't way off. Yeah, oh, okay. yeah. Got, got up out of there. I saw his uh, special on HBO, and he was a star day one. How about Pharrell? Pharrell's good. Actually, I like him. Pharrell. I think. I, like I think him. Virginia. His, his hooks is. You got to think. Timber. Shake your Timber. ass, Tim. I think Virginia might have the greatest producers of all time. When Is you. When you. I mean, shit, everybody, Timberland, Timberland. the Neptunes. Uh, if you go further back, um, I want to say, I don't want to get this wrong. What's the Green Eye do name? Wow. Really look at dude's <laughs> eyes. But now Who's that you're looking at dude's eyes. Green Eye dude that produced no, all the I'm music back saying, in the 80s. You're man. looking at dude's eyes. Who you th- I don't Come know on, who you're talking about, I bro. think Virginia has the best producers, though. If, yeah. you, if you go down the you list. You don't want to remember the dude that you saw as a Green Eye? <laughs> <laughs> you start trying to get away from him. Like, hey, forget the nigga with the Green Eyes. <laughs> He want me to help you with the dude in the green eyes. Oh, well, his name was Carl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Shout well, out to nah. Virginia. Did you ever hear Allen Iverson's album? Allen Iverson? I didn't. Oh, come on, man. You I gotta, did it. You got to get I'm on slack. that. You call me slacking just now. Yeah, 40 bars, man. Y'all got to get on that. Ooh. Yeah, I'm going to play some His on special break, was uh, very good. It was, it, and it's so weird because they got a movie coming out, pretty much the same thing that happened to Allen, which happens to a lot of black men. And there's another young man that happened to him in his pro career, but he he never got a chance to play in the NFL. The movie is about to come out, I think, next week or next month. And AI story, which was the same thing. When he got he didn't get into the fight, somebody else did, but the only person they knew was Allen Iverson, and they said he started the fight. You're talking about the bowling alley? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and he almost lost everything, and he actually was in jail. They just lobbied to get him out. Early because he was supposed to do five years, and I think oh. only did like two months or three months or something like that. And it could have went really bad. We would never know who Allen Iverson was. Bubba never, Chuck. Man, that dude was a beast. Special. Man, man. Special. So no more ball playing. No. Those days you went overseas. Where'd you play overseas? Um, Germany, Austria, Finland. Damn. I finished off in uh, Israel. For the past four years. And I was telling my son, I said, you, you, you don't even make it to the league. Even though I don't care where you do. I just want you to go to college. Uh, you can go overseas. Yeah. And, and you can get it, man. They're yeah. they looking for some, uh, some out, players. Out of all the places you played, where was the best competition? The best competition? Germany. Played in the top top league out there. Um, you got your oh. seven-footers. You got 6'11 players. Like handles. Christoph Porzingis. You know, oh, playing right, on the right. wing. Yeah. I'm 6'6". Six, six, so I'm over here looking up like... What am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> you know, so <laughs> now do they still limit the amount of American players can be on the team? You limit, but you um so in Germany you can have five NBA play or excuse me, five Americans. Um you can also have international players, you know. So I had a player on my team from Iceland, mm-hmm. from That's Serbia. Dope. You know, wow. You were starting or you were I was starting. Oh, yeah, yeah, I was twenty four years old playing in uh the top league in Germany, which is an accomplishment and um, you know, I stayed out there for a little bit. And then, now you're your senior year, you're six six or what? my senior year, I was six six. I went into college at six four. So you were already by sophomore year, you were what? I was about six five, six six. Oh, you were already yeah, there. So you know, you already knew what you were gonna do. Oh yeah, he oh definitely. He ain't gonna be wearing a Taco Bell long. <laughs> he gonna be out of here. What was the biggest surprise about playing basketball overseas? Any, overseas? Yeah. What was the big difference? 
just a, it's a culture shock. You know, all you know is America. You know, you grew up American. And uh, so you go over there, all different type of language, different type of foods, different cultures. You I know. was about to throw another one in there. <laughs> Dim duck <bears. laughs> Hey, you didn't hear that. <laughs> <laughs> Just the guys talking. Yeah. yeah, I was going to ask. So do do American basketball players get treated like celebrities once they go overseas? It all depends on the work they way. It depends on who you play for. You know, if you play for uh, some of the top leagues, then yeah, you know, you get the recognition, you get the shout outs, you get the love. Everybody treats you well. If you play for the bottom of the barrel team. I never would have made it back. I don't know who you are. <laughs> First girl would have like, oh, you can shoot. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, now, if you had a choice to either go go do college or to go straight overseas from high school, would you? From high school? You would have went. What would you do? Everybody got different paths. Right. For me, I know I need a college to develop. I won't ready. But you got these kids that are coming out of high school doing crazy stuff, crazy skills, you know, mm-hmm. stuff I didn't see in high school. Mm-hmm. And, um, yeah, for that, I would go overseas. You know, go get your money because you don't you don't hey. know when that injury is going to happen, if it happens. If it happens. God willing. Yeah, shout out to uh, yeah, I hadn't gotten hurt. Brandon I Jennings. You know I would have went overseas. Exactly, right. Brandon Jennings. Yeah. Yeah. I would have went overseas. And I think uh, I think Mellow Ball is going to play in Australia this over this yeah, yeah. yeah. This yep, summer. Yep, yep. How, is it, how is that playing in Australia? I, I've never played there. I know a couple of people who play there, and uh, I hear it's love. You know, the competition is good. Compared to college, maybe you might get more from college. But the thing is, he's going to the NBA regardless. Yeah. So it doesn't oh, yeah. matter. You know, go get your money, start out, yeah. get that experience, and then move on. A lot of Bentley and then come on back. <laughs> Pretty much. It is the Rollout Show. Uh, don't forget now, tell them where to go to get the band and the workout. AugustinaFitness.com. And this go Shit. Right, that's no, you have to try it. Put it around your leg. Uh, will. <laughs> now, 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 really quick. I know you call it the butt band and all of that. Yes. Um, strength band. I'm sorry, Thank you. Strength band. Strength band. Yeah. Now, I do. I, I train kids doing basketball stuff, and a lot of times I try to avoid weights. And mm-hmm. a lot of stuff we usually use is band work. So I want to know if you can kind of add a little bit into any workouts you guys do with the bands that some you know oh, men yeah. can get involved. Absolutely, in. especially like with guys too. You know, and it's super easy to use. You can do all your warm ups. It activates your glutes, your legs. So before you do any like heavy workouts on your legs or um, squats, you know, you want to make sure that you warm up with the booty band or strength band. Yeah, I can't warm up. <laughs> Listen, I got, I got, I got an idea. You guys should get a guy version. It could be the same thing. Just and just call it the strength band. It it is. You can you just no. turn it over. You just do it like <laughs> this. The booty Watch. right there. <laughs> the, there like look, there you go. There you go. There you, you the go. Band. That's it's what I'm doing. Band. I wonder by what is that that booty band? No, bitch. It's a band that somebody gave me for my booty. <laughs> but you can get the band. And what's the website? AugustinaFitness.com. Go there and get the band. Support, y'all. Support. Uh, and and if you need to get the workout in, and we know you get in the band, of course you bought to. You said what's my what? I said I know you're going to get a band because right. you want to get right a booty. Can we can and we my get knee. Uh, and my knee. yeah? Can we do like a like a demonstration video for the for the fans? Yeah, we'd have we to can. do it today, ahead, but I think Shelly would be up for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yes, go ahead, Shelly. Go ahead. Not right now. <laughs> no, yeah. Don't, don't you know work your mean? booty. Might as well get get it started now. Not, See, not today, sir. Not today's today. not a day. No. Right. You don't want to demonstrate. Right, you should demonstrate, Speedy. She, she could show you how men use it. I can't even pull this thing apart. Man, <laughs> no, I'll help my... you. I'll help you. Man, that's going to look even worse. <laughs> this girl helps me put my booty band on. <laughs> now spread your booty. <laughs> 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 it's like you put it on like you put pants on. Yeah, again, my... my yeah. Now, I would say I've actually I actually do a lot of band work. Um, so I would tell people, anybody that's dealing with any kind of injuries, you got any kind of, you know, Definitely. spots in your body you worry about definitely go with the band work instead of lifting instead of weights 100 percent. and you, it goes up over the knee well it depends over the knee it's going to be easier under the below the knee it's going to be harder so so because you have you're able to stretch it more mm-hmm. when you use your thighs than when you use your calves hey pops we got to get you on the booty band man <laughs> <laughs> yeah, gotta get you on that making it worse i'm at this does it does it help your calves Hilarious. Yeah, absolutely. See, Your entire life. He likes to build his calves. Really? Yeah, see, yeah, somebody made a comment about his calves being <laughs> really developed. Really, <laughs> Shelly, you reading, you reading these motherfuckers what they say? <laughs> I was reading what they said, what they were uh, saying. You don't want to read this. They, they I was smoke. like, damn. Yeah, they, they, they you shit. are. Yeah, they're ruthless. Yeah, these motherfuckers ain't shit. That's their job to hate, though. Damn. So. 
That's it. There used to be the hateful eight. Now there's about a hundred people in there, so they all hateful. They were just it's saying. Spread. They were just saying that what our information should be on Pornhub. <laughs> <laughs> Coming soon. Coming soon. Booty band. That, that might have been from the previous guest. We oh had, yeah, the, yeah. The, the was previous guest yeah. report. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. It would be. Damn, I was like, I was like, they're <laughs> Hey. No, I don't think that was for you. Yeah, that, the other girls were porn oh, stars. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so his, uh, this is you right here. This is all oh, y'all. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering why you kept going like this. I was like, what? Fitness, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I am not no, going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, it's not the first time that I've been called that. So <laughs> yeah, that was, that was the other girls. So go get the band. Uh, uh, Shelly, probably later on the week, you'll see her in Crunch. I mean, don't be and you know what? And we, have, we have oh, tons no. of demonstrations on Instagram too. Okay. So um, I currently don't have because a lot of people were asking me about that. Oh, I yeah. currently don't have a booty band program that you can get on my website, but I do have other programs like a course layer program to work your abs, a thirty day program that you know you guys would love to do that too. You guys should do it as a as a group. <laughs> he won't do it. <laughs> but the girl. It's a hell of a commitment. Thirty days. How about three minutes? I three minutes. You don't even show up for that. Shut no, up. he was sweating at the gym the other See? day. Dude, he no, because there's another fitness woman that comes in here, and we all were supposed to meet. I was the only one that showed up. Damn. Nobody showed up. You're really not gonna let it go. You know, it's like three weeks ago. And you were supposed to meet again on Monday. <laughs> she was out of town. FYI, Shout out to Monday. Rancho Cucamonga, by the way. What happened there? <laughs> <laughs> That's where I first moved when I started. When when, oh, when I okay, first yes. met you, I was driving all the way from Rancho to Westlake. Yes. Oh my God. Wow. I know. Far. You was driving Rancho. My uh, sister used to live out there, Rancho Cucamonga. That's far. That's where. Uh, for, no. Yeah. That's where Bugs Bunny lives. That's Bugs <laughs> Bunny. He's not, Bugs he's not real. Bunny. That's if you, you look on that? when you watch cartoons, <laughs> it's Bugs Bunny lives in Rancho Cucamonga. Oh, no way. Yes. Really? Anybody know? Next they, Friday. Yeah. Next wow. Friday. That's funny. That's where I know it from. Next Friday. Yeah. So that's how I know Rancho. It's on the way to <laughs> Vegas. Uh, thank y'all for hanging out, man. Appreciate it. Thank uh, you. All right. We're going to get the. Get the booty, booty band. band. Yeah. Why do you keep looking at me? Because I'm not going to say <laughs> it. You, you can say it. Plus, you want a, you want a booty. See, you keep saying I don't need one, but you keep looking at me, looking down. You're like, you want a booty. So clearly you believe what I believe. <laughs> no, I believe that you're wrong. But as <laughs> we ain't going to win no matter what I say. Win. But if I say you ain't handle as we be, that's so fucked up. Just tell I the never, truth. I thought right. I did. I said but you But you're fun. being, you're you sending going. mixed signals right now. Right. I am? Yes. Absolutely. Maybe. All right. Yeah, you're, you're yeah, let me go and get out of here because this fuck is it's going bad. It is the Roll Out Show right here at RollOutStudios.com. It's y'all. Hey, man, go go to the website again. Go to AugustinaFitness.com. Bam. Check it out. Give your information. Just Kells. Just two underscore Kells on Instagram. Kells. Is it Kel, is K-E-L? K-E-L-Z. Okay. Do you, do you train uh, basketball players or anything like that? I have in the past. Right now, I, I'm not. He's we talk lifted. about it. He we just, talk about it. Hey, and, listen, you know, man, I'm trying to. I train kids. Let me tell you something. Yeah. You can get that paper right now. Uh, right, I know. right. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, she keep telling me, man. I, I've been telling listen, him. Listen to her, brother. Slide my son. He's at, he's at uh, El Camino. He's, a, he's only 15, clients, 14. Slide you, Here's man. how I see it. You, you have to have... You have to have clients. Like you have to know people. You know, I don't know no, nobody. No, I you started know. not knowing nobody. I got some clients. I can slide you, brother. Because his knee messed up. So yeah, I can't. It. I can't. I haven't had been working I mean, my we clients. We can definitely so. talk about it. We can definitely. Yeah, link man. Up. You gotta get on that, yeah, brother. Sure. It's out there. Trust yeah. me. Yeah. Yeah, and then you get the booty man on him. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> man, go, win we, win. It's, it's a straight. Band. Put on your <laughs> booty bands and let's go, guys. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> You got the music. It's the Rollout Show. We'll be right back. Sneakerhead. We got uh, mo top movies. And Shelly's supposed to have something. I don't, I don't have anything. Fucking happen. Well, you got 10 minutes to figure it out. <laughs> so <laughs> we can come back and talk about booty bands or whatever you want to do after that. Uh, it is the Rollout Show.